How many people in this room have a will? Put your hands up. Okay, 50% of the room. Thank you. How many people have powers of attorney? All right, riddle me this. Something happened to you yesterday. Sickness, maybe you're not here. What happens to your business? Who signs the checks? Who pays the salaries? What happens to the business? What happens to your team? What happens to your clients? As business owners, guys, we owe it to the people who serve us. We owe it to our team that are actually giving us their time, giving us their life, giving us their energy. We owe it to our family, the ones that we're building this to protect. We owe it to all of the people who encourage and support us in our lives to protect them. In most cases, business owners sign sh they don't even know what they're signing. Who's read their constitution? Show of hands. That's your fucking rule book. Who's read their trust deed if they're operating under a trust? That's your fucking rule book. Guys, that is the rule of which, that's the, the, the structure. If you're in a proprietary limited company, it's a constitution. If you're in a trading trust, it's a trust deed. This is the rule book. This, is, this dictates the terms in which you are allowed to engage and play the game. It's in simple and easy to understand English now. Don't be scared of it. You can read it. It's easy to read. I promise you that. It's got an index at the front. But you need a will and powers of attorney. Are you going to get them? Oh. Guys, girls, ladies, gents. These are simple documents. Simple documents. You can get drawn up, in some cases, for 50 bucks. Right? They're not going to hold a huge gravity as far as uh, legal weight's concerned. Better to have something than nothing. Are you going to get your wills and powers of attorney sorted out? Yes. Are you going to get them? You promise? Yes. Thank you.